No one is ever going to use Shopify after this. This tells you everything. 4.9 on Trustpilot, and this is Shopify. I mean, 1.3. Well, I think I know a better place. And it's mostly because of the features and the ease of use. First of all, just click the link down below. You will land on this page. And here I will show you how to create your shop for yourself with total ease. This is especially good if you're a beginner. So on the homepage, just scroll down and click on Dokan Cloud Shop. When you click on it, First of all, as you can see, you can start a 14 days free trial, so you don't have to pay for it. You can see whether this is for you or not, but trust me, it is. Click on this button here, and then just choose one of these options here. If you wanna open up a shop, make sure this here is selected, and then you can choose one of these plans. Whichever one of these plans you choose, you are gonna get 14 days free trial. That's more than enough to see if this is gonna work out for you. So let's just click on this one here, then create yourself an account. You can simply just use Google for it. Sign in and this is gonna be your dashboard. First of all, here is the button to create a new site. Click on it and then this will open. Today, we're gonna to go with standalone shop because that's the topic for today. Here you choose a shop name. I'll just name it beginner shop like this because it's so good for anyone. Honestly, you don't have to have any kind of experience. Now I'll click on start creating shop. Now I'll just answer a few of these questions such as which stage are you in? What is the size of your current audience? And what's your previous experience running a business? Just like that, click on the next button here and then choose a country choose the site language. You can see there's a few options here. And of course, enter the address as well. Click on the finish button and your store is being created. Now this is gonna be the dashboard of your shop. Let me just increase the size of this one. So congrats on the new store. From here, all you have to do in order to start with this one is to set up general settings, to set up payment, and to set up shipping. All of these are so easy to understand. And you can see by the layout, the user interface is really great. All the things that you will need are gonna be here on the left. But let's just start with the general settings here. You can just click here on general settings or here under the settings tab on general. And here is where you put in the basic information about yourself. You can change the store name. You can choose the time zone. You select the site currency here. There's of course many options for this one as well. The whole world is probably here. And then of course you just enter your email address in this box. There's an option to allow guest checkout. For example, if you don't want people to create an account. And then down there, there's store visibility, whether you want it to be private or public, and then you choose your units. So whether you want metric or imperial system here, this is where you can change that. All you have to do is to click on the save buttons once you do everything. Then there are business details. These are the ones that we already did. Then there's domain here. And this is what is great. By default, your site gets a free Dokkan subdomain. But you can add your own, right? If you have a brand. And this is a brand here where you upload your logo. You choose the brand colors. And of course, your social media goes here. Just paste them all here. And then code snippet is here. So these are the general settings. After that, we can proceed to the payment button here. It is under settings payment. Now, these are all gonna depend on your location, right? For example, my business location is the in the United States and I have next options. I have Stripe. You can easily connect this just by clicking on connect here and down there you've got PayPal for the US as well and then you've got cash on delivery. You have to enable this one if you're gonna do it that way, or you can use bank deposit here. Just click on the connect button here, and now you can use wire transfer on your shop. Now, if you change the country here, you have to do it through business details that we've seen earlier. But if you click on that button, it'll lead you straight there. This is what I love about this one. The user interface and the experience here is way better than anything else I've seen because it's all here. You don't have to second guess. And there's always gonna be a button leading you to where you wanna be, right? So here I can choose the country now and I can change this to, 
let's just say Germany for this example. So here it is. I click on Germany. I put the address and the postal code, the address, and then I just head over back to the payment. And here you can see that for Germany, you've got Stripe as well, but then you've got Mango Pay there because this is available in Germany. And this is gonna be for every country on the list. If your country supports different method, you have to choose your country and then you just have to change it here. And if you wanna connect Stripe here, you will click on the connect button here, for example, and then you have to enable all of these here. So if you wanna use credit card or debit cards, click on the enable button here, you give it a name, you give it a description, and then you just click on save changes. The same goes for Alipay, Affirm, Afterpay, whatever you wanna use. Next on, shipping here. This is so, so easy. You just enable this here. Just click on this button here. And here you choose where you want your products to be shipped. If you want it to be anywhere in the world, click on this button. If you wanna use any particular countries, click on only these countries, and then just add countries here, such as, let's just say, Australia, and let's just say, let's just say Belgium, right? So these are the only countries that are gonna be available to buy from you now. Or the third option is to, you can set your products to go everywhere except these countries on the list that you put. So for example, for some reason, you don't want your products to go to, let's just say Egypt. Now, the products are gonna go to the whole world except for Egypt. So whatever you choose, click on the save button here and then down there you can choose shipping types right shipping type is a way to group similar shipping rules together so these are two examples you've got international and you've got domestic standard shipping that's the shipping type you can always edit these just click on it you can change the name you can change the category but of course you can add your own shipping type by clicking on this plus icon add shipping type and then you give it a name and then you select a category. Everything on Dokkan is easy to understand and it's intuitive. You don't have to second guess. You don't have to waste time. You don't have to be overwhelmed by the interface or something. Adding products, shipping, orders, marketing, designing, it's all here and it is easy, very easy to navigate around. Also, just have a look at this. This tells you everything. 4.9 on Trustpilot. This is the Dokkan. And this is Shopify. I mean, I don't have to tell you anything else. I mean, 1.3, well, I think I know a better place. Also on Dokkan, everything is drag and drop, plus additional CSS customization support. While on Shopify, well, they've got something which is called liquid coding. And even people on Reddit are having a hard time with it. I mean, just take a look at this subreddit. It's called Programming Horror. And this is where they talk about liquid coding. I mean, it speaks for itself. One more thing, with Dokkan, you've got 27 support on all plans. While on Shopify, well, it's just not the case. There's a ton of hidden fees as well on Shopify, and if you want unlimited storage, if you want to scale, well, open your wallet wider. Dokkan, on the other hand, unlimited storage, unlimited bandwidth and scalability. Pricing flexibility is also better. And you can run an entire marketplace here. I mean, that's something that you can't do with Shopify unless you want a complicated life. And yeah, no transaction fees? Well, I think we have a winner. The link is down there, and if you act now, you have a chance to get this anniversary sale, which is available now. It is 50% off for the annual plans. So yeah, click the link down there and just enjoy yourselves. Dokkan is a breeze, especially good if this is your first shop ever. And yeah, 14 days free trial. You don't have to guess whether this is going to be for you or not. Just go and try it out. Wish you good luck and I'll catch you in the next one.